Stepping through code, watching variables and pointers, setting conditional breakpoints, and viewing and editing processor memory are all essential debug capabilities, and for a long time Altium Designer has had all of these and more. But when it comes to debugging embedded designs, and in particular multi-threaded real-time systems, you need to be able to emulate the final operating environment as closely as possible. To that end, Release 10 brings with it some key embedded debug enhancements. Namely, the ability to attach a new debug session to the target CPU, even while that CPU is already running the embedded code. This opens up a whole lot of possibilities to see the status of the system after billions of clock cycles of real-time operation without slowing it down. You can launch a new debug session with a running processor from Devices View. Just right-click on the target processor's icon and choose Attach. The system will pause execution and open the source code editor with the current execution point highlighted. Now you can step over code, set breakpoints and watches, or examine the contents of memory or peripheral registers. Any of these debug panels and tools can be accessed without messing up the state of the target CPU attained after the execution time leading up to that point. 